Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Kone. This is Enzo Loyodis. Gusto. And they're almost inviting them to come at them. Real chance. There is the goal. And you could almost see that coming. They were sitting ever deeper. And now they've really paid the price. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Big chance! He's blocked it! Oh, he squandered the opportunity. He might be relieved, though, to see that the offside flag is up. Well, the linesman sparing his blushes here, but you have to say, it was a shocking effort. Malo Gusto. Juhash. And with the advantage, no reason why you shouldn't play keep ball. Mbappe, well, it could be on for him here. And a goal! Another one! Two in quick succession! No wonder they're celebrating! Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance. And Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal. And into the last 20 minutes. Pashkanu. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. El Yawahi. Teo Hernandez now. France looking dangerous here. And a fine cross. He succeeds in clearing it. Who can he pick out? And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. An opportunity for 3 0. A goal! Accurate from the spot. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Well cleared away. That's a lovely ball. Really? Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Substitution time it is here. Well, the pass got in the way. Well, it looked as though it might be problematic for the keeper and the defenders, but they've got away with it. Well, he eventually clutches the ball, but they've got lucky here. That really looked like being a goal, didn't it? Pashkanu.
Pashkanu. That's a good ball. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Gusto. Juhasz. Room to roam here for France. It's a perfect challenge. And they need to get tighter here. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Alexandru Pashkanu. Now what can they do from here? And still trying to get the shot off. No way through. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Can they make it count? Oh, big chance. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal. And just look at the celebrations. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They're bossing the game now. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Well, they kept a shake defensively. Job done for now. And that is all the final whistle has sounded. And that makes it official. They're through to the next round. Well, what a good attacking display that was. The passing, movement and creativity were of the highest quality. They'll certainly be confident going into the next round. Here it is now, a substitution. And Norway regaining possession. And support available. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Malo Gusto. 
Well, good run and good ball control. Can't miss, surely. It's gone in. And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, here we can see just how good this goal is. It has everything. Skill, pace and power. There was no stopping him there. So the action is restarted, and it's been a goal-scoring masterclass from France so far. You sense it's a question of how many. Andreas Schulberg, Hanke Olsen. Berg. Holland. And he saw the situation developing. Juhasz. Dembele on the ball. 20 minutes remaining. And quick thinking defensively. Holland. Holland. And possession lost by Norway. Dembele Juhasz Malo Gusto Running with the ball confidently What a vital intervention Marcus Holmgren Pedersen Berg. It's with Erdogan. Holland. And continues his run. And there is the goal. He's found the net. Joy unconfined. Well, just look at his movement. He knows exactly how to find space. And it's also a tidy finish. That's a nice goal. So back underway at 3-1. Holland. Well, that's a foul. And it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. It didn't have the beating of the wall, unfortunately. Clear deflection and a corner now. And played short. Pulls it back. Well, whether it's a great chance or a half chance, when you're trailing as they are, you've got to put them away. Well, if they are going to get back into this, those are the sort of chances they have to take. Ibrahima Konate. Juhasz. Jules Kunde on the ball. Kamavinga. And Norway with the ball again. And teammates to play it to. Oh, a fine block. Now veering in field. He cuts it back. Crucial piece of defending. Well, oh, good technique in terms of how he struck it. And a substitution in the offing. Juhasz. And just five minutes remaining. Dembele. He's going forward well here. Good looking cross. 
And a time for calm on the ball. And the counter looks on here. Options available. And he takes it away. Holland making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Options in the centre. Can he get one back? Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Getting forward. Mbappe, real chance. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Fired over by Usman Dembele. And clearing it away. The referee's whistle. And a real treat in store for the travelling fans. Because they can now get ready for the final. Well, that was an excellent display. The result was never in doubt, in my view. They controlled the tempo of the game, they looked threatening when they went forward, and they had the better individuals. They'll certainly fancy their chances in the final. And the substitution will occur now. A tremendous vision. Onana. Attacking possibilities for Belgium. But they took care of the situation defensively. Charles de Quetelare. Well, he's certainly not alone. Onana. And the shot. So back underway, they've leveled it at 1-1 here. Teo Hernandez. This is Enzo Loyotis. Juhash. Loyotis. They've regained possession. Arthur Teat Amadou Onana Ikoma Luis Openda Oh, that's a really good pass Well, he had just gone beyond the last defender, Stuart Well, that's a real shame because the through ball is really well weighted but he just took too long to play it Teo Hernandez Fair challenge, and it will be a throw in. No nonsense clearance. And that is going to be a free kick. Into the final 20 minutes. 
Belgium being afforded too much space. And that was a very fine read. Moussa Diaby and France exploiting the space on the flank. A chance to whip it in. And just blotting out the danger. Well, maybe a good position from which to counter. Now room to roam on the wing for Belgium. And the precision was lacking. Throw in coming up. Teo Hernandez. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Wahi. And making considerable progress with the ball. Well, really rifling that one in, and he didn't miss by much. And he has options available. Incisive pass. Oh, he stopped it! Well, I thought that would be a goal, but what a save. Great reactions. Let's see about the delivery. A bit short with the clearance. Diaby. On to Nkunku. Oh, a really good save. And it remains all square. Well, he's just saved his team from defeat here. It's a great save, I would say. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Can he put them in front? Oh, yes! The goal that might well be decisive. The goal that could give them the trophy. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. It's just a change of pace. But he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Ikoma Luis Openda. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. And they deal with the threat this time. And an astute piece of defending. Belgium out wide here. Fine cross into the middle. And the penalty has been given here. Chance to even things up here. And throws it home. Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Why? Kunde. Juhasz. Teo Hernandez. And forward they go again. Can they win this? Diaby. Return to Nkunku. a super piece of defending well the counter chance looks very real Openda Jeremy Doku and continues his run is this the moment diving save to deny the opportunity well this corner could be pivotal it might represent the last chance to get in front and the goalkeeper's touch that was crucial well that's it for the 90 minutes but this is not over and two 15 minute periods of extra time
So making the substitution now. So back in business here. The first period of extra time. And it might well come down to mental fortitude. Who wants this more? And they went strongly in for the challenge. And the result is a throw-in. Hernandez. That's useful play. Real chance. There's still danger here. And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can sense the relief amongst his teammates, but what a first save that was. Well, he's gone back to give the free kick, the referee here. He tried to play advantage, but it didn't accrue. Moussa Diaby. Well, here it is. Head down, hit through the ball and get it on target. That's a top-class finish. There was no stopping that. You can't really say defences are on top. 3-2. Janssen Ikoma Luis Openda and the electronic board showing one additional minute Well, that's it for the first period of extra time. Let's see what the second has in store. And it is substitution time at this juncture, not just from one side, but from both. The cross is on. And tucking it behind for a corner here. Trying to deliver it accurately. And ably dealt with. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. Loyo Dis. Juhasz. And Belgium regaining possession. Time is fast running out. Five minutes left in the second period of extra time here. Well, keeping the ball in this manner can be very effective. Wahi. That's a good looking ball. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. 
Yep, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. It's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And now this is really special, isn't it? The chance to run with that trophy over towards the fans and say thank you and celebrate together. Well, they're absolutely right to do that. The fans deserve to celebrate as well. They've been excellent. They've made so much noise here. Great scenes. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.